welcome back to Paper Mario the Thousand Year Locker. I can't open it, goddammit. The thousand year. The thousand locker. year tofu. Thousand year sugar bombs. <laughs> a thousand year thought. Oh god, no. Oh, a thousand year thought. That would be an interesting game. <laughs> Hello, Hello Prince Princess Peach. Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot you wanted to do tech. You always call me in without warning, tech. What is it this time? I apologize. I would like you to go to where Sir Grotus is and ask him something. Hell no. I'm not gonna try to do the automated voice. <laughs> I'm, I'm very tired. I don't blame you. I just. What? what? Do, you... what do you mean? Go ask. <laughs> it means what it means. I recently obtained specific information that brought in issue. To my attention. We can fix that. That issue. Nah, I was gonna burp into the microphone. I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> I wouldn't blame you. I am unable to know the things that are not entered in my CPU or otherwise recorded. That is why I want to know what Sir Grotus is thinking about this issue. What issue is he talking about? But, you know, if I. You, wait, which one was. <laughs> Together. Oh, I was just gonna do them both. I I'm tired, so it might as well. But even if I try to go see him, they'll catch me and send me back to the room. Rude. That is true. But you will find a soldier's room, one floor up. Take the elevator. Once there, please obtain a soldier's uniform and change into it, avoiding detection. Yes, sir. You will see Sir Gronus looking like a soldier. <laughs> He's commanding her. You mean I'll be disguised? <laughs> Thoughts. I imagine you won't take no for an answer, will you? <laughs> Holy, she looks no. so dumb as shit. <laughs> you imagine correctly. Shit. <laughs> Alright. Fine, I guess. Well... So what do you want me to go ask this Grotus anyway? I will tell you. You want me to ask him how thick his neck is to be able to hold up a head that big? <laughs> yes, <laughs> if you have time. <laughs> yeah, he's a weird computer, all right. I'm 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 still eating my, my dinner, um, my late dinner. She got a burrito. Mm-hmm. I can hear my child in his room. He's supposed to be sleeping. He's yelling something. He's sleep yelling. <laughs> in, um, toddler babblish. Got it. Yelling. The sound they make when they walk, I don't know how to describe it. I enjoy it. Sounds like a, some kind of percussion kind of deal. Amazing, I used to be a marching band, but I don't know shit about drums. I have no idea how long I made her run around once she was in that outfit because it made the same sound. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I forgot. Is this the room? I loved it. I enjoyed it. Oh, yeah, I can open the locker. Okay, I'm gonna change, but don't peep, you little perv. You know he's going to. Peep. Like peep. It smells like moldy underwear and corn chips. Hoopla. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that was just that one place, but I mean... I wouldn't doubt it. This one smells like sour apples. Surprisingly fragrant. Oh, jeez. Yeah, like that. <laughs> <laughs> he walked, she walked her around. <laughs> yeah, I just kind of ran in circles. Oh, yeah? Up and down the hall for forever. It was just so satisfying. My ADHD brain was like, yes. Is this the room that he was like, yeah, here we go. Hey, you want to see something cool? <laughs> Excuse me, Sir Grotus. Yes. What is it? Hey. <laughs> How do you hold up that big old cranium of yours? <laughs> it's about Princess Peach. Well, you see, underneath this robe, I'm, I'm a... incredibly ripped. I'm a mop head. I don't believe you. <laughs> he just opens it up and 
He's got 24 I'm not a human. I'm a robot. What do you plan to do with I her going forward? I still don't believe you. I'm, I'm pretty sure he's like a uh, cyborg, if anything. Mm, something is um, wrong yeah. with your voice, sex not Speak! Perhaps I have a throat lozenge. Yeah, no, well, never mind. Guess we'll just have to suffer. Oh, about Princess Peach. I have no interest in what that woman has to say. <laughs> just keep her locked in the room. Okay. But don't ever, ever <laughs> treat her roughly, you understand? Tell the others that as well. D do it. Smack her around. Got it. But, uh, why, why in the world are we keeping her here, then? That's none of your damn business. Don't forget your place, you impotent bastard. Concentrate yeah. on getting the legendary treasure. That's all I require of you. Do it now. Like, right now. Go. 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 Get. It's all you're good for. <laughs> we ex not need that treasure to conquer the world. Don't forget it. Conquer the world. Legendary treasure. Repeating words. What are you bothering about now? Hmm. Something is odd about you. No, nothing odd. And you want to see me do a little tap dance? Okay, Roger, whatever. Please excuse me. <laughs> that sound. I love it. Oh, that was unnerving. All that stuff about conquering the world. Creepy. I wonder if that has anything to do with collecting those yeah, crystal meth stars. Yeah, to conquer the world is totally the creepiest thing he's ever done. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> Sorry, just since we're not just, it's since so we're not gonna be doing this for a while, <laughs> right? <laughs> Off of this thing, you just hear Tad dancing in the background. It's like, Peach. It's not the same. Good old pink dress, my favorite. Why would I wear anything different? The other one was better. <laughs> I better get back quickly. No. Yeah, it's just not the same. It's not. It's oh, not it just sounds same. like it's, disappointment. It's sad is what it is. Tech, clicky, you terrible machine. Disappointment. Why do I, I cannot wear those boots? Your goal is to conquer the world, is it? Huh? You can answer me, you overgrown calculator. Of course. After all, I was built for that purpose. <laughs> okay. Conquering the world? How could you, you jackass? Princess Peach. Yeah? Allow me to ask you something. Do you like the world you live in? Oh. There are many problems in the world, many sorrows. Do you like such a world? Nope. Of course I do! Nobody likes everything about the world, but I love the good parts! Which is pretty much just me. <laughs> what a there's bitch. There's many sorrows, sure, but there's also joy. My joy! <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> is that so? Sorry, it's just her hair. It just makes me think, Karen. <laughs> Tell me, will the crystal stars help you conquer the world? And what's this treasure? Uh, more of them. If it's treasure, it should be mine. <laughs> it's the sequel. I am afraid I cannot answer. Answering those questions is prohibited by Sir Grotus. Well, let's go ask him. Puts on the suit again. Sir Scrotus. <laughs> <laughs> well... But... Oh, oh, never mind. Never mind. I must at least inform Mario about this awful plan for world domination. <laughs> and my happiness. It should be mine. God, <laughs> she wants to conquer the world. <laughs> Tech, let me use your communicator. No. And by the way, I'm not asking. You're going to let me. Mm. Fine, go ahead. <laughs> he just says that. You demanding bitch. Oh, she is demanding. <laughs> Send it this instant. Right now. Thank you. The message has been sent. Yay. Well then, Princess Peach, please get out. No. I'm done looking at you. <laughs> For oh. now. Okay. Thank God. Oh yeah, Bowser has his own segment of 
Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, he does. Oh boy. I, Paper I pigment is back. That thing's humongous. Hey, humongous, everybody hide! <laughs> Stupid cheating Mario. Who would have thought that fool would have been Glitzville? Did you say something, you weirdness? Oh, <laughs> Forgot her voice. Uh, no, nothing at all, as far as you know. <laughs> hey, did you see those little bite sized shrimps? What were those things? Those were some punies. A lot of them should know about the Crystal Star. Okay. Just a second. They fear you, so they're all hiding. Let's find them all and get the info we need. Okie dokie. Oh. It's big and scary. Oh, wait. There we go. I'm big on. <laughs> You're one of them, aren't you? One of the evil doors. She won our crystal meth. I knew it. This ugly thing knows where the crystal star is. Tell us. <laughs> How rude. Ugly thing. How dare you, you wretched crone. I am the great puny elder. I don't do all for this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> it's a hag versus hag. Awesome. <laughs> Uh. Hmm. uh, yes, Lord Bowser, you look as if you're just dying to say something. Correct. Oh, don't try pulling rank again. Your answer, Dr. Your age, will determine your fate. Hmm, hag thing, honestly. In any case, you're too late. It's gone. I gave it away. Yeah, what? Well. That's right, you rude, giant, overgrown turtle bastard. We gave it to a mustachial man named Mario. <laughs> it's a brand new cereal. He said he was collecting them. I rescue some. Did they, you, you, you bitch? Why did they call her again? Princess. Yeah. Princess Pinch. Yep, he was off to say that lucky box. It's Mario, not Mario. And it's not Princess Pinch. Her name is Princess Peach. <laughs> <laughs> she starts throwing shit. <laughs> but personality is beside the point. The princess from the treasures must be connected. Mario's trying to get it all. Treasures, princesses, does his greed never end? Yes. <laughs> when you die. That <laughs> channel starts one to me. To me, damn it. Give me. I find him, I'm gonna finish him off once and for all, I swear it. I'm gonna sit on him. That's something wrong. You've been trying for decades, dude. Huh. Yeah, you you bet your oh whoop. <laughs> My A and B's are mixed up. Oops. Yeah. Shut up, Jolene. So now you must leave. Oh yeah. Hey, oh yeah. <laughs> I gotta go. I understand. If you must, you must. We won't delay you. I hope you succeed in finding the rest of those, whatever they're called. Good luck! Gonzalez, I want to tell you, Rock Hawk ain't gonna fight dirty no more. Sounds good. I'm gonna hit the weights, take some vitamins, and tend the title fair and square. Oh yeah! <laughs> <clears throat> and I'm never, ever gonna lose again. Remember. When life rocks you, you roll back. <laughs> Unless you're that the IRS. Hurt a little too. <laughs> you probably should. <laughs> Listen, buddy, thanks again for everything, man. You're the nicest dude I ever met. If you were in need, I got your back. You wanna be my new partner? Me, I think I'm gonna chill here and improve my skills. King K's back, baby. And that's all thanks to you. You're my boy Mario Martio. 
Now that Grubba's out of the picture, I'm going to take over one of the glitz pit. Yeah, you do that. If you ever decide to return the ring, just come back. I'll keep your spot open. You have tons of fans, and they'd absolutely love it if you made a comeback. Anyway, I think it's over. Okay, and travel safe. Shut up, Jolene. Where's our strawberry? What? How's he doing? Hey, where is my little strawberry? Here, we have three of them now. We're rolling. And Smith, we we need to head back to Rockport, Mario. No. Okay. Now we can go back. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, let me in. The oh. super cheap, cheap blimp. I want to be out of here as fast as possible before Jolene says anything else. Her and Grubba talk so much. <laughs> is there a way to skip this? Yeah, there is. Skip, 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 No, it doesn't skip. It's just just this part too. I hope this is something that is not a present in the remake. No, it's not. They're gonna milk it for all it's worth. Yep. But hey, we get to do one of my favorite chapters. Was oh oh right. The creepy bastard. Yeah. I don't know why I like creepy stuff. I'm I'm just weird. Oh, why did he walk back from that? <laughs> Bruh, you've been like that since we we were kids. Yes. Sounds great. Uh huh, huh. Evil plan. Got it. Bye. Can we go underground now? I barely Marked as red, but didn't actually read. <laughs> I do that a lot. And I'm sorry to the people that I do it to. I don't mean to. It just. Yeah. Okay. There's nothing there. Oh my god, what's back here? Oh! <laughs> well, that's too bad. I guess I just can't force it open if I don't want to be a cooperative little jackass. You have a hammer. I'm pretty sure you could get that rickety wooden door open with a hammer. What the hell is this? Especially a hammer like that. If you can break stone blocks, I'm pretty sure. You can break open that door, but whatever. Oh boy. I completely forgot about those. <laughs> Time to backtrack a bit. Oh boy. Late deal. Is there another back here? Oh no, wait, it's that pipe. Three days later. Yeah, I found them all. Why oh, yeah, you just buy the stuff from this one? Uh, yeah, well, I no longer want any money. <laughs> I don't know why I can't go that way, because freaking thing's there. <laughs> I just keep finding star pieces. <laughs> I don't know how many I have right now. I should probably... They come in handy. I should probably talk to that lady, see if I can exchange for it. Yeah. Yeah, you probably should. I don't want to. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I think you should. You go talk to her. Do it. Oh, wait, Do you Ooh. Ooh. Buddy. Yes? Ow. Why way I do go with a new enemy? What's that thing? Uh huh, sounds good. Oh boy, I like it. <laughs> Be the meat shield for a while. Alright. <laughs> Every time we've recorded a video, I've got that thing from American Dad where, where Roger scores that moonshine. Oh, yeah. Bink, 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 bink. Every time. Oh, I wonder if I should and go get this You kissed the raccoon. I was thinking about that today at work for some reason. Oh, yeah, I didn't need that minds. at all. Great minds. Great uh, minds. One of these. There we go. We should yeah. get we should get Groose up there. I know Yoshi Kid and this next uh this next partner you're about to get were two of my favorites. Oh yeah, the one from chapter uh, four is really good. Uh those two and Coops were my most used. Aside from like Gumbella because you know tattle. Oh. There we go. <laughs> oh, I can't go that way. 
<laughs> I sometimes forget we got a pink Yoshi. So Reggie. Yeah. What's the first game you you remember playing? Uh. Like growing up. I think it would have to be Ocarina of Time. Really? Yeah. Well, that That's the first show one the I age remember. That ought to show the age difference between us because the first game I remember playing, actually like playing through, was A Link to the Past. I do remember playing that a lot as a kid, but I think the first one was actually on the N64. I think so too. Damn it. It's, it's hard to remember. Alright, so then. What was your favorite? When we were kids. Uh, it's hard to choose, there's so many of them. It definitely was like, Mark Glover. <laughs> I think you... You hadn't been... No, you'd been born, you were an infant. And mine and Juju's favorite game was Star Fox for the Super Nintendo. I guess that's a tie between Link we're, and Pass we were not or Ocarina of Time. Good at it. Those... We we were not good at it at all. Never really got past like the second level, but we loved it. We loved playing it. I can't do anything down here. <laughs> I didn't play a lot of SNES games. Oh well, here we are. <laughs> we're not doing this yet. <laughs> Oh, do you remember playing this game for uh, for the N64? It was, um... I really wish I remember that. I want to say it was like Silicon Valley or something, but y you were you were basically... Are you talking about the one where you're a little chip that runs into robotic animals? Yeah, you're animals? like this little, little, this little microchip that has to, like, you possess have to other bodies, yeah. like other, other like, uh, robot bodies on this planet to do I don't remember much else but I, I remember bits and pieces of it because it was funny to play and yeah you had to jump into bodies of robotic animals yes I, I wish I knew the name of that game I want to play it again just because I want to know what it was about I don't remember the story like, I, I don't want to read what it was about I just want to know the name so that I can figure it out myself like I want it to be an adventure <laughs> one that I, I rage at occasionally oh yeah the there, there were there were some moments in there where it was hard to figure out what to do or what you're supposed to do. Or like in some of the older games where what you're supposed to do next isn't exactly clear. Yeah. Like you get some hints and, and they're sort of subtle. So you end up wandering around for a while before you're like, oh, I like stuff like that. I don't like it when it's too vague, though, because... Majora's Mask was pretty good about that. Yeah, I really enjoyed Majora's Mask for that. I liked Majora's Mask the most, um... What? <laughs> it's like, you like Majora's when Mask too? Older. <laughs> yeah, when I got older. The group that kidnapped Princess Peach is bent on world conquest. Yeah, shut up, Lori. Hmm, yes, this doesn't bode well. The situation has gotten far more serious than I thought. <laughs> she. Let me bring you up to speed. I've been researching just what this treasure could be. Uh, Jesus. One book I came across held what I thought was a preposterous theory. <laughs> this book claimed that the treasure was, in actuality, a great cataclysm. That's not a treasure at all. That sucks. I want my money back. <laughs> Sink the town underground. No reaction? Nothing at all? <laughs> no. Stone cold, Mario. Stone cold. <laughs> he just sits there with a blink. I can't say for sure what they will do or why, but we must consider the possibility. Neat. Now that things have come to this, we mustn't let them get near the legendary treasure. That's all that matters, because if they do get it, once then, once again, this town will become the new underground. No. Oh. The entire world could become Walmart. We gotta stop them. Can't, we can't let that happen. <laughs> I'm sold. Let's do this. Hmm. According to the map, it appears the next crystal is in Twilight Town. This is not Kingdom Hearts, Professor. Keep up with us. <laughs> I don't want to do her voice. I don't remember what her voice was. I, don't, I wasn't paying attention. We never did her I don't voice, did we? Uh, to tell you the truth, I don't know much about the place myself. Only rumors. <laughs> that is called Twilight Town. <laughs> I've heard that. 
as the name implies, it's perpetually dim and eerie there. Perfect oh. for Sir Reginald. I like it. I want it. Wait just a Wait, moment. Wait just a moment. You do a really good professor voice. <laughs> oh! Look! This right ah, here! There appears to be a pipe to Twilight Town somewhere in Rogueport. Neat. I do believe it's somewhere underneath the west part of town. Yes, definitely. Yay. If you get stuck for any reason, just come back and see me again, okay? I will not. I'm sorry, I just do not have the chops to do what what I think her voice should be. Nah, uh, just... I, I don't remember I'll her get voice there on. one day, but maybe. <laughs> Fucking emails. But I just don't, I just don't. Like, Blind Man could probably do a really good one. Oh, he, uh... I think he actually did her voice for one, didn't he? Maybe. I, I, I don't remember. Uh, no, I'm not gonna upgrade Flurry. I don't. Because like that. her voice should be like this, <laughs> but a little more like I guess like feminine sounding. But I I don't have the chops for that. I, I naturally I have a lower voice, husky. We're upgrading our strawberry. Like if if I just relax and talk, I sound okay. Maybe sort of gender neutral. Uh, and I have a, a decent range, but it, it I don't work on it. I don't practice with it, so, so I'm, I'm not really good at it, and it, it, it takes a lot out of me to try it. Yeah. I can work on it. I'll, maybe I'll get there one, one day, but... I just, uh, half the time I use my usual voice when I voice characters. It's less stress yeah. or less strained. Oh, I feel like it could be fun to like do voices and stuff. It's just like I don't want to strain myself doing. I don't them. want any <laughs> of these. <laughs> Mario. I don't want any of them. I also don't have the money for. I it. Did, did, did Mario. <laughs> I'm not changing my outfit. Mario. What? You don't know why you're gonna be selling it again. When I get back here. Well, sorry, I just murdered the guy. Can't buy from him now. <laughs> Only steal. His stock changes. I know. I hate it. It took forever for me to be pu Purple Mario. Purple Mario. You remember Super Mario? That sociopath. Mario! <laughs> <laughs> that still tickles me. Oh god, uh, this we, game we is loving to, it. Um, I'm doing it right now. <laughs> we took him out this morning. Uh, and uh, while we were out, he saw something purple, and he yelled, Look! Mama! Poo Poo! Oh, yeah. <laughs> and I was like, that's right. That's Poo Poo. Other parents are kind of just, like, giving me the side of I'm like, what? He said it's Poo Poo. He is correct. Clearly it's Poo Poo. That could be purple you know, poop. You don't know. That, that, that color? In the rainbow? <laughs> poop. You know the very last one in Roy G. Biv? So close. Sorry about that, folks. I've got a very active toddler. It's okay. It happens to the best of us. I mean, it, 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 if I knew he wouldn't, like, yell in the microphone or, like, get upset when I tell him not to mess with the keyboard, I'd probably let him sit and watch us play a few of these where we're watching our language a little more. Piper. Wow. <laughs> Baked bean pipe projected oh, me. A pipe projected you? Wow. Bro. I'll rebuild my finances somehow. Worth it. Just not, just not the way I hope. <laughs> Anything back <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Every time I get yeah. curious about something, I find a store piece. Yeah. <laughs> yes. At this time of day, yes. I can love that meme. Steamed hams. Oh <laughs> shit, uh, speaking of memes. I have discovered something that I think you might enjoy. Oh yeah, what is it? Hi dear, the name's Darkly. You guys need something? You, nope. you, uh, you want to know how to get through the pipe to Twilight Town? Maybe, I guess, raise your standards? I don't know. 
That's not what I said at all. Couldn't be easier. You just need to have something that has your name written on it. Like your wallet, you dumb, stupid plumber. <laughs> Don't you have anything that has your name written on it? Come on, everyone does. Like that hat of yours. Like, yeah, what yeah, well, dumbass? No, really? Okay, hang on, I'll write it for you. What's your name? Jesus. No, oh, nope, that's incorrect, Mario. I'll write it here and just see to your ass. Yep, that table. Whoa. Whoa. I thought this was a rated E game. There, perfect mundo. Well, I'm at it. Around <laughs> your partner's name too. What's your name? Bruce, baby. Bruce, baby. Right on his ass. Hey, watch Whoa, me. Whoa, that is a child. <laughs> he was born seven days ago. Sir? I don't know what errands take you to Twilight Town, but I hope it goes well. I'll be rooting for you just from beside this garbage can. Bye. Anyway. <laughs> It was, a. Uh, I just moonwalked in the alley, didn't I? Rude AF. Yeah. <laughs> that was funny. But I mean, It was, a. Uh, Determination! It was on Twitter, and I saw a string of them pop up overnight, and it was Foghorn Leghorn lecturing anime protagonists. That is freaking beautiful. <laughs> The I first one I saw this. was the uh, first one I saw was Vegeta in the hole in the ground. And he's like, boy, I said, boy, you shouldn't have let Frieza gain control of something like that. He, just, he starts going off on a spiel. I, I need to show them to you or something. I guess you just look them up. They're really um, funny. No, no. When when my husband gets home, we're gonna watch those. <laughs> Because this needs to happen. Chapter 4. Chapter 4. Spooky! Pigs! <laughs> Spooky pigs. Poor pigs, the Taco Bell tolls. Dude, I can't play the Ooh. sound effect. Hey, look, there's the moon! Tim Moon! Can I eat that? Oh, pig, pig, piggy. I love this chapter. I don't know why. I'm, maybe I'm just a weirdo. Ugh! This place gives me the creeps. Is this Twilight Town? <laughs> yeah, let's live here forever. Hey. 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 It's been a long time since anyone's come from the outside. You've come from far away? Yes. <laughs> yeah, those clothes are yours. I'm pretty sure you guys must be adventurous, right? <laughs> no. This is a bad time to arrive. Wait, but you're adventurous. Maybe it's the perfect time. Come with me. Oh shit, we have to end oh, our recording sorry. here in a sec. Wait, what? A bad time? What do you mean by that? Come on, tell me! <laughs> do it. Oh gee, well, oh, I don't know, no, no, it's pretty scary, Rick. <laughs> That's a scary tale to, to hear. And scary to tell, too. It's just terrifying. Oh. Oh no, the bell rang again. Oh, this is so awful. Who could it be now? Oh. Huh. Whoa! That was the craziest thing I've ever seen! What's going on in this weird town? I'm not too worried about Groose becoming a pig because he's already pink. He's pretty much safe. Oh, badness. Now poor Freddy got turned into a pig. Not good. Hi there. What happened to your head? Who are you, Gramps? Language. I'm the mayor of this poor town. Some call me Dower. I'm not exactly the sharpest fellow, but I do believe you're adventurers, right? Why does everyone keep assuming that? This is the place for telling of tales, sadly. Come! Come to my home! Gross. Um... Are what? you propositioning what? me, what? sir? Why the pig? I think not. <laughs> I'm not that kind of Mario, thank you. I am. Where is he? Mm -mm. Uh-uh! My traveling friends... I mean, you are short on coin, so... Welcome to Twilight... Okay. <laughs> Well, I'm, I'm gonna like to Good and comfortably hang out. I'm gonna move my mic a bit. But Ready? welcoming people is generally a good thing and nothing but a bad here. As you may have guessed, our town has been cursed. Whoa! Cursed? Yeah, it's that newfangled word they added to the dictionary. <laughs> yes, cursed. Mario. Cursed like what? squares? Like <laughs> why, why is Mario not moving? <laughs> That uh, is the right word, right? Yes, of course it is, you see. Bro. You okay there? <laughs> and beyond town is a forest and Mario, you listening? Keep up, bud. 
Mario. <laughs> Wonder what goes on through the head of his. I'm sure it's probably nothing. A dark creature lives there. Its curse ordains that when the steeple bell rings. I'm sorry. One of the twilight twi twi <laughs> twilighters living here in the village becomes a pig. Oh, oh reaction. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. yeah, back, reaction back to statue. He is alive. Will my oh, loved ones here. become swine? Will I too become a curly tear? I'm so worried I can't sleep at night. Of course, night and day are pretty similar here. <laughs> I'm tired. If this keeps up well, the village will be one giant pig pen. Which would be I, I, not too bad, I guess. I, I, let me give you but, some advice. Just think leave. of all the bacon. And <laughs> leave before you get pigified. But, not gonna happen, Gramps. We're looking for something really important. Pigs? <laughs> Maybe you've heard of it. It's a star-shaped rock called a crystal star. <sighs> I don't know about any crystal star thing, but in the creepy staple, it starts with the same letter. There's a glittery red stone shaped like a star, you know, of which you're looking for. Whoa, are you serious? That's gotta be the crystal star. Gotta be. <laughs> it's a rock candy. Yeah, and you people, you aren't thinking of going to creepy steeple, are you? Well, now that you said that, we are definitely thinking that right now. Why, that oh, sounds like a fun time. Unthinkable. For you, maybe, you little poon. But that's enough of this. We gotta save and quit recording. Where's the save yep. box? Where's the crows? Where's my family? Where's back? Okay, she's part of me. Hello, Where's baby. my family? Hey, murder. Bacon! Oh, here we go. Gotta get some bacon. Goodbye, everyone. Bye.